Hello boys and girls, welcome to science class. Today we'll be looking at simple tools and machines. Simple tools and machines. Simple tools and machines. A tool or a machine is an object used to do or carry out certain work or task. That means you can use a tool or a machine to carry out some work or some task task and why do we use tools and machines we use tools and machine because they make our work easier and faster so if you don't want to waste time okay you should ensure that you use some tools and machine for example if you're coming to school in the morning and you don't want to get to school late okay instead of trekking what do you use you use a car so if you if you if you trek and if you take a car you will notice that you'll get to school faster or on time okay you get to school on time if you take a car but if you trek you can you can use like you can use more time so using tool or machine will make you carry out some certain task in a very easier way or in a very uh yes easier way or to make your work faster there are some tools and machines that we use at home we use them in the classroom we use them in the farm, we use them in the hospital. And why do we use them? So that we can do what? We can make our work easier and faster. That's why we use tools and machines. It's not that we can't use any other thing, but because tools and machines will always make our work faster, we have to use them. Examples of tools and machines found in the home are bottle opener, for example, you want to open your Coke or you want to open a wine. Okay. Instead of you can, you, you can't even, if you want to use, some people will do what? Some people will use their teeth and that will spoil the teeth. So it's, it's the best thing to do is to look for a bottle opener. Then you use it to open and it will even be faster. Or if you are using your, your teeth to open a bottle, number one is going to spoil your teeth. Number two is going to waste time. Greater is also used, is also a tool used in the kitchen or at home, basically. Okay, so you'll be looking for how to grate your your um okra or your onions. When you get, get a grater, it will help you to do it very fast. You use a needle, a needle is also part of tool and machines in the home. Egg whisk, okay, egg whisk will whisk your egg faster than if you want to use a spoon to whisk your egg nail cutter some people will use their, their, their teeth to cut their nails it is not it is not hygienic it is not hygienic and it might even spoil your teeth so using a nail cutter is a faster is a is a very fast way a faster way of of cutting your nail you can also a knife is also part of the tool used in the Home. then a blender a blender pot gas cooker you know you can't compare a food being prepared on a stove and a, 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 a food being prepared on a gas no cooking on a gas will be is more faster than cooking on a stove so the tools and machines help you to help your work to be more easier and faster so these are also other examples of, of tools and machines used in the home. You can see the mug, the blender, the boiler pan, the, the food processor. You can see the cutlery, the knife, the ladder. So many tools in the home that you can use. The wooden spoon, the rolling pin, spoon, the mixer, the pan, and so on. Even the potato peeler. So there are so that these are tools in the home that will help you 
to make your work easier and faster. Now, examples of tools and machines used in the classrooms are blackboard, painting brush, duster, or can you just get uh, a clothes and say, oh, I want to clean the board. No, it won't even be neat. So you get a duster, which is a good tool for cleaning the, the blackboard. The notebook is also a tool, eraser, ruler, pen, and so on, are tools that you use in the classroom to make your work easier and faster. You can see it. These are tools in the classroom that will make your work faster and better, okay, and easier as well. So these are the tools, as you can see them. Okay, so we'll move to tools in the farm. These are tools and machines that are used in the farm that will make the work in the farm easier and faster. For example, we have the tractor, we have the hoe, we have the cutlass, the shovel, the axe, the wheelbarrow, rake, and so on. This is the tractor, and it is used for road constructions, for building, and it, as you can see, okay these are also other examples of tools in the farm you can see the uh, watering can instead of using bottles instead of pouring water in the bottle to water your plant and the flowers you can use the, this watering can to help you and it will be very easy easy and fast wheelbarrow you know you can use wheelbarrow to carry stuff from one place to another around the farm the fork you can use the cutlass to cut your grasses, the oats also cut your grasses, the rake to pack um, your grasses together and it will make your work very easier. Okay, the hose for hose pipe for water. I know this is a uh, sprinkler. These are tools that will make your work easier and faster in the farm. Now look at the O. This is the this is the axe. It, it's used for what? Cutting wood. Okay? To make it easy. Instead of you looking for knife or looking for other things that are not uh that that won't uh, cut your, your wood well. So you when you get, get the axe, it will help you to cut your wood effectively and faster. Now let's look at tools in the hospitals that will help the doctors and the nurses do their work well easier and faster we have the thermometer which is used to check temperature we have the stethoscope we have the bandage we have the blood monitor and so on those this these tools will help uh, those who work in the hospital to do their work faster and easier like I said, this is the thermometer to check temperature. And the, these are also, uh, look at this. The what? This is the stethoscope. And it is used to listen. It is used to listen to internal sound of animals or human beings. So you use this to listen to internal sound of human being or animals so we have so many um tools in the hospital that you use also the blood monitor to monitor the blood level okay so we have other examples of tools used this is the blood uh, monitor the other examples of tools in the hospital that will help the uh, doctors and the nurses to perform their work faster and e easier, easily. Okay, so what are the safety ways to use the tools and machines? Tools and machines, you, you have to use your tools and machine properly. You have to because you can't just take any tool and machine if you don't know how to use them, you have to learn how to use a particular tool and machine before you use them. So you have to use them properly. Then the second one is always keep them clean. When you are done using your tools and machine, make sure you wash them, keep them clean, and put them in good condition. Yes, keep them in good condition. When you wash them, 
you, you'll be uh, rest assured that they are in good condition. Also, avoid running or playing when carrying sharp or pointed tools. When you are with your um, your tools and um, machines, make sure that you avoid running or playing or playing around because you need to keep them and um, you need to make sure that you you keep them in good condition you keep them in um good condition you keep them clean and you also avoid running around with them because when you fall then the tools or machine can get damaged so avoid running or playing around when carrying your tools okay apart from the fact that you might also get injured the tools and machine can also get damaged okay so that is all about um tools and machines and no, note that the main reason why we use tools and machine is one to make our work easier and to make our work faster if you have any question please send them through the comment box